back live from the Avalon. The George Taylor Morris with you again to spend a few minutes with our headliner tonight, Capitol Recording Artist and Boston favorites, the Push Stars. These guys uh, were named the best unsigned band in America a couple of years ago. They won the coveted Outstanding Rock Band title at the Boston Music Awards in 98 and certainly approved their worth on the road with their debut album, After Party. Drunk is better than dead when you're stepping it down inside your own head. So you hang out with the man on the moon, but why does the morning have to come too soon? When you get stuck down deep in bad traffic, all your radio's picking up is cheap static. So you reach beneath your front seat for the taste of something so sweet. We just remember what the young man said. A little drunk is better than. I was uh, paying a Boston gas bill, and uh, I called up, and it was from the computer roboticized recording saying, if you want to tell us how poor you are, push star. And uh, it's a very phone call. I, I got a gig offer. Uh, so the guy said, what's your band called? And the first thing I could think of was, uh, was the push stars. When you ask to stop by too many doors You think of all the good things you can't afford You are uh, on the label that the Beatles were on when they came to America. Oh, that's one of the reasons I decided to sign with Capitol Records, you know, for them and Frank Sinatra and the Beach Boys, just bands that, and groups and singers that were uh, had a great pop, pop sensibility, you know. And uh, we'd like to be in that overall genre someday. bio that you used to stutter. Yeah, I still do. <laughs> Were you totally self-conscious about that as a kid? Like, did it just blow your mind, or? Uh, well, I think I started writing songs because of that, because I couldn't really talk to people, so I would write songs to, to kind of tell girls I liked them and, and to kind of tell friends they were important to me and stuff, so, so it's why I started writing songs. And it still applies, although, I, I mean, I've gotten better. I mean, back in high school, I couldn't say, you know, two words. Yeah. So now I've improved because cause I've had to because I have a very public job now. So it's like, you know, I've been, been kind of forced to really speak up. 